Amen, Rasan, many times, but a particular time that I recall that was um, very, um, uh, I could, I could just hit mind blowing. That's all I can say. Rasan had suffered a stroke, and his left arm, I mean, his right arm was paralyzed. So you got to understand that this guy is blind, okay? He's blind, one arm, you know, he's got a paralyzed arm. So he's in the club playing a flute with one hand. Now, normally, you know, you play flute with two hands, and it's off to the side, and it's held horizontally. But Rasan took this flute, and what he did is he took the head joint from the flute, and he heated it on his stove and bent it at a 90 degree angle and then he hooked it up to the regular body of the flute and he took a piece of a coat hanger and soldered it to the body of the flute so he could support it with his neck strap since he didn't have a one hand and then he took the left stack of the clarinet keys and use them to connect the three keys on the bottom of the flute. There's only two other keys that you can play, but anyway, he got all but two notes of the flute that he could play with one hand. And he did this blind. And I was just amazed. So I'm listening to him playing. You can't tell that, you know, if you weren't watching him, you would never know that he was playing with one hand. But anyway, I went backstage and I said, Rasan, I'm just, you know, amazed at these, these, this instrument you got. He said, oh man, I, you know, I, I just put it together at home. And um, I said, you mind if I play it? He said, go ahead. So anyway, I played this instrument and it was like the smoothest, uh, easiest playing flute that I ever picked up in my life. But if you looked at it, it looked like, um, I don't know if you're familiar with a robot chicken or anything like that, but it looked like something to come off of that, you know? It was really, looked strange because he had stuff soldered and glued, and, but the horn played, uh, it was just incredible. So, you know, he said, yeah, I got something coming from the factory just like that. And I'm just, just, you know, uh, you know, amazed that somebody could even think that instead of being defeated by the fact that not only was he blind, he was paralyzed also. And then he still played better than 99% of the flute players that, you know, out there. So that's my Rasan story, you know.